Assalamu alaikum friends my name is Muhammad Javed and you are watching Science Tech Pakistan Science Tech Pakistan is the first scientific and student oriented YouTube channel to update our youth about the latest technological revolution in the world first of all I want to say thanks for your positive feedback encouragement and to subscribe our channel your support is the key driving force that give me energy to make new and informative videos for all of you from the field of technology, biology and science. Artificial intelligence and biotechnology are ranked among top two disciplines that will shape the future of this world. Today, I will discuss a brief introduction of modern biotechnology and its potential impact in every discipline of human life. In my opinion, biotechnology has a single line definition that is combination of biology with a new technology. Biotechnology is a multidisciplinary subject and typically associated with the seven broad disciplines as a standard classification and is also associated with more than 15 modern emerging technologies that I will discuss later in this video. Let's see what these different colors of biotechnology indicates. Red biotechnology deals with the biopharmaceutical industry for the synthesis of medicines and veterinary clinical products, including vaccines and antibiotics. It also involves regenerative therapies and genetic engineering to improve healthcare and to help the biological system to fight against diseases. Dark Biotechnology Bioterrorism is the dark side of biotechnology and is classified under the term dark biotechnology, also involving bio-warfare, bio-crime and anti-crop warfare. Bioterrorism is using biological organisms to spread fear among people. Bioweapon is the use of deadly germs to kill the enemies. Dark biotechnology is much about a negative aspect of biological science and tools. Yellow biotechnology deals with the increased production of a food by characterizing the genes of the insects. Yellow biotechnology uses plants to silent and to target the genes of the insects. As we know that, more than 200,000 species of the insects are herbivores. They depend on plant for their food. Gray biotechnology deals with the removal of pollutants and contaminants by using microorganisms and plants to protect our surrounding environment suitable for life. The main concern of gray biotechnology is to maintain the biodiversity and to remove heavy metals and hydrocarbons from the soil. A great example of this is the Carlo based SME Microgen Biotech Company which is helping to clean industrial pollutant land in China. Blue Biotechnology is based upon uncovering the natural resources of the sea to create products of industrial importance. As we know, sea presents greater biodiversity and is a potential source to provide benefit for a large number of sectors to boost the economy of the country. One prominent example is the use of wound dressing coated with chitosan. Chitosan is a sugar that is typically derived from crab shells. There is no doubt blue biotechnology has a huge impact on red biotechnology that is a biopharmaceutical industry. Green biotechnology is one of the central area of research in the field of biotech. Green biotechnology is related to agriculture. It is important to note that agriculture is the art and science of cultivating the soil, growing crops and raising livestock. Green biotechnology applications include creating new plant varieties of agriculture interest producing biofertilizers and biopesticides. 
This area of biotechnology is based upon genetic engineering to prepare genetically modified or transgenic crops that have extra gene into their DNA. This extra gene may be responsible to increase or decrease the height of a plant or to introduce any desired character suitable for the growth in the available conditions. Green biotechnology is very broad field and have diverse range of applications that I will discuss and cover in detail in the separate video. Next and the most important type is white biotechnology that relates to industrial biotechnology. White biotechnology mainly focused on designing low resource consuming processes and products by using raw material. In white biotechnology, raw materials are used along with the microbes and enzymes to synthesize number of available products for human beings. Different consumer products made with industrial biotechnology are vitamin B12, cosmetics, detergents, papers and textile, carpets, polyesters, synthetic rubber, biofuels, ethanol, antibiotics and many more. Scientists are working to replace fossil based products with the bio based products by combining chemistry, biotechnology and fermentation technology, bio wastes are converted into useful products. In this short introductory video, we have discussed briefly about red biotechnology, dark biotechnology, yellow, gray, blue, green and white biotechnology. In our next video, I will discuss emerging trends in biotechnology, connection of modern biotechnology with artificial intelligence, machine learning, nanobiotechnology, bioentrepreneurship, space science, big data in biotechnology and lot more.